Rectangular prism. A rectangular prism is a solid three-dimensional object uh, with six rectangular faces, like these shapes that you can see here. To find the volume of each rectangular prism, you can use this formula. Volume V is the length, length you can just write by L times width, W you can write, times height, H. So if you multiply this side, the height, and this side, if you multiply these three sides, you get the volume of the rectangular prism. The surface area for surface area means that the areas of all these six faces is two times, two times because each face we have the similar one in the back. So we have one here, exactly the same face in the back. So it's two times, then WH for one of them plus LW and then plus LH. So take a look at here. This face is 12 times 5. This face is 9. The area of this face is 9 times 5. And this one is 12 times... This one is 12 times 9. Let's take a look at the volume. Let's find the volume and surface area of each rectangular prism here, the shapes that we have. So for this one, volume is easy. Just multiply all sides. 8 times 5 times 4. It is 4 times 5, 20 times 8 is 160. And it is cubic meters. That's the volume. But the surface area is 2 times the first face here, this face, is 5 times 8. So it is 40 plus. This face, the shaded face, is 4 times 5. It is 20 plus. And the other side, this one, is 8 times 4, which is 32. So if you add these, you get 60 plus 32 is 92 times 2. It's 184, and it is square meters. Next one, volume of this one, easy, just one side, the length times high times width. If you multiply these, just use a calculator, and then multiply 12 by 9, then times 5. The answer is 540. So 540 is the volume, 540 cubic inches. And the surface area, just right here, the surface area is, uh, the surface area equals to two times so just face by face. This one is 9 times 5 is 45 plus this one here is 9 times 12 it is 108 and the other one so we found this one we found this one then 5 times 12 is 60. The last one the last face that we have here if you add them up so 45 plus 108 plus 60, then times 2, you get 426. So the surface area of this one is 426 square inches. Next one here, volume is 8 times 6 times 2. So 6 times 2 is 12 times 8, it is 96, and the measurement is cubic meters. And the surface area is 2 times, so this one is 2 times 6 is 12, plus this one is 2 times 
8 is 16 plus this face is 6 times 8 is 48. Now if you add these, 12 plus 48 is 60, that one is 76. So 76 times 2 it is 152. So the surface area is 152 uh, square meters.